sitting on your mat. So getting that upper body opening, just rolling those shoulders up to your ears, back and down. And then rolling those shoulders up to your ears, back and down. Rolling those shoulders up to the ears, pull them back. Put the hands on the floor behind. Bend the elbows. Pull those upper arms together. Lift that chest up and forward. And then straighten those arms so that you hold yourself in column. So try not to lean back on your, on your arms like that, leaning back. Try to be pushing forward. So that you're feeling yourself on those seat, directly on those seat bones. <clears throat> you can shimmy yourself left and right a bit and just feel those seat bones. Lifting that chest up, take that chin all the way up to the sky. And then pull that chin all the way down into your chest. Pushing forward still on those hands, pulling those shoulders back. Bring those eyes all the way up to the sky. Push that chin all the way up. Keeping that chest up, lifting off that, those seat bones and then bring those, that chin all the way down into the chest. And just holding yourself here, you could push your right foot forward and feel are your seat bones even. And then push your left foot forward and realise that they're not quite even. Push that right foot forward so we're loosening that sacroiliac joint up. Keep that chest up, push that left foot forward, push that right foot. Push that left foot and then level those feet up, lifting that chest up, pulling those eyes down to, towards the navel more, turning those eyes to the right side of that right leg, pulling the left ear away from the left shoulder, lifting, lifting that head, rotate that face a little bit so we just change the angle of pull on the neck. And then bring those eyes across to the left side of the left leg, keeping that chest lifted. Keeping yourself up on the front bottom, middle bottom. Pulling that right ear away from that right shoulder, pulling those shoulders together. Turning that face ever so slightly to change the pull on that neck. Keeping that chest lifted up, bring those eyes back to the centre. Take those hands together behind your back, hold the hands together. Squeeze and slide those hands away slightly on the floor and lift that chest slightly up in the front. Slide those hands away slightly, lifting that chest up, keeping that chin pulled down, pulling those toes to the nose, pointing those toes away. Pull those toes to the nose. Squeeze those shoulder blades together, point those toes away. Take the feet to the right, all the way up to the sky, all the way around. Three circles that way, pushing those hands away, pushing that chest up. One more circle, and then the other way. Keep that chest lifted, keep that chin down. Two circles, three circles. Release those feet, release that head and neck. Let go of those hands, bring them onto the thighs. Breathing in on the out breath, slide those hands forward down towards those feet. Reaching down towards those feet. Leaning forward, pushing that head over those toes. Soften the knees, pull that body forward onto those thighs, pulling the armpits towards those, the, above the knees. Pushing the head forward. Keeping those feet vertical, holding those feet, pulling those knees apart while those feet are parallel and vertical. Let those knees roll towards each other. Pull those knees apart, holding those feet vertical. Pull that head up over uh, towards above the feet. Breathing in on the out breath, push that right knee down to the floor. Release, push that left knee down to the floor. Release, push both knees down to the floor. Release those arms, bring yourself up nice and tall. Roll those shoulders up to those ears, round and back. Big breath in, rolling those shoulders. Put that left hand on the right knee, right hand behind. Lift that chest up, pushing off this back hand, turning around to the right. 
Breathing in, breathing out. And then come back round to the front. Put the right hand on the left knee. So lift that chest up. Lift that chest. Good. Well done. Left hand behind. Right hand on that right on that left knee. Lifting. So I'm not leaning on this left hand. I'm pushing off it to hold myself in column. Lifting the chest up. Trying to push that those rhomboids together. Pulling that the shoulder blades together. And then coming back round to the front, hands on those legs, breathing in. On the out breath, sliding all the way down, pushing through those vertebrae. So just rest yourself here, push out on that lower back, push out on that middle back, push out on that upper back, and then lengthen the head towards the feet. So you stretch. And then sliding yourself up to vertical, rolling those shoulders up to the ears, round and back, put those hands a bit further behind on the floor. Hold those fingers towards you so we get a bit of a wrist stretch as well. Breathing in, breathing out, push up off those hands, pushing the heels of the hands into the floor. So we stretch those wrists, flexing them, lift that chest up, take those eyes to the sky, try and straighten those elbows, bring those knees down, pull those toes to the nose, lift that chest up, breathing in. Bring that chin all the way down into the chest, breathing out, push off those fingers. So roll through that hand. So we stretch those fingers, slide yourself all the way forward, hand over those feet, toes in the wrist, fingertips in the arch of the foot, pull those feet towards you so you flex that ankle. Pull those feet, put both hands on that right foot and pull the ball of the foot towards you. Put both hands on that left foot and pull that foot towards you. Put one hand on each foot, pull those feet in, push those knees down, release those feet and push them away from you. Let us extend those ankles, really point those toes. Bend your knees a bit, reach up and push forward on those toe joints with your fingers. Push those toes forward. Soften the knees a bit, soften the ankles if you're getting cramp. Push those toes down and then pulling those toes back up towards the nose. And then release those hands, lift yourself up nice and tall, roll those shoulders all the way up to the ears round and back. Roll those shoulders up to the ears round and back, put the fingertips on the floor behind, lean backwards onto those hands, stretching through those hands, let, uh, let the elbows come soft, breathing in. Breathing out, lift that chest up, push into those wrists, stretch those wrists, lift that chest up, pull those um, arms, stretching those armpits, lifting that chest away from those upper arms. Breathing in, flex those ankles, tighten the thighs. Breathing out, point those toes, and then push off your hands, off all the way through those fingers, and come up to vertical, bring those arms up in front, breathing in on the out breath, lowering all the way down to the floor, one vertebra at a time, slowly down to the floor, rest that head down, bring those arms all the way over the head, reach and push those fingers from the, from the toes, push the right hand from the right foot, lengthen through that right side, push that left hand away from that left foot, Lengthen through that left side. Push the right hand from the right foot, taking hold of the right wrist, take it left. Walk the feet left, cross the left foot over that right foot. Keep those hips down, become a banana and stretch. Breathing in, breathing out. And then release those arms, walk those feet to the right side of the, of the mat. Cross the right foot over the left foot. Walk those hands to the, to the right, drop the bum, leave that left, push that left foot away from that left hand, reaching and stretching, pushing the left foot away from the left hand. Stretch through the armpit, stretch through that side. Bring those hands back to centre, bring those feet back to centre. Bring those arms all the way up to the sky. Push those hands up, push that, that, that middle back into the floor. Pull those shoulders into the ground, squeeze the blades together. Bring those hands apart, palms to the sky. 
Squeezing those shoulder blades together so the spine lifts away from the mat. Breathing in and on the out breath, bring those hands all the way up to the sky, pushing that spine into the mat. Breathing in. On the out breath, release those arms all the way out wide, squeeze those shoulder blades together, lift that spine up off the floor. Breathing in. Breathing out, bring those arms all the way together, push those shoulder blades up towards the fingertips, push that spine into the ground. Flatten that lower back into the ground, feel those legs lift up a bit, bring those hands out wide, arch that back up, pushing the tailbone in the ground, squeezing onto those shoulders, and then bring those hands up to the sky, flattening that back into the floor. Push those fingertips up tall and then release those shoulders onto the ground, come into that neutral position. Bring those arms down to point to your feet, chin into your chest, and then roll yourself all the way up to sitting, hands on those legs, and roll yourself all the way forwards. All the way forwards towards those feet. Breathing in, breathing out. And then bring yourself up to vertical. Bring that roller in. Bend those knees up. Bring that roller in. Put those feet flat on the floor. Breathing in. Breathing out. Rest on that roller. Rest on those bottom ribs. And then releasing over that roller. Take hold of the head in the hands if you need. Breathing out. Open that chest up. Stretch through that back. Stretch through that chest. And then bring that head back up. Move that roller up a bit, breathing in. Breathing out. Open all the way over that roller, pushing that chest to the sky, bringing that head to the floor. And then bringing that head back up. Move that roller up a little bit higher, breathing in. Breathing out. Push that chest up, let that head sink back. Loosen that head and neck. And then bring that head back up. Breathing in, move the roll up a bit more. Breathing out, stretch, lengthen. Holding that head in the hands, roll that roller down towards those bottom ribs. And then back up towards the base of the neck. And towards those bottom ribs. And then back up towards the base of the neck. Going on to that left side a little bit. Leaning on the left. Going through those um, facet joints, pushing on those ribs all the way down. All the way back up. And then go all the way over onto that left side. Through those bottom ribs. Leave that left arm on the floor. So that's nice and straight and long. Rolling that roller through the side and then stop when the roller's in the armpit. Rock that body forwards and backwards. Lift that bum up or roll the roller down a bit. Rock that body forwards and back. Rock that body forwards and back. Moving down through those bottom ribs. All the way into those bottom ribs and then all the way back up again. Spend some time in the base of that shoulder blade. Spend some time in those muscles up the back of the armpit. Notice where you're tight and work on those areas. Moving that roller all the way up, all the way down through those areas. Support the head with the underneath arm if you need. And then rolling back onto the back. All the way up, all the way down. And then all the way back onto the back. Big breath in, big breath out. Keeping that bum low, keeping that head low. And 
And then on to the other side, onto that right side. And then rolling all the way over, leaving that right arm straight underneath. Through those bottom ribs. And stop with the roller in the armpit. Keeping that underneath arm straight if you can, rocking forwards and back. And just moving the body along the roller, feeling where you're tight. All the way down to those bottom ribs. And then all the way back up again. In through that armpit, and then all the way down, all the way up. And then rolling back onto the back again. All the way up, all the way down. Big breath in, big breath out. Opening over that roller. Resting the head on the floor, resting the bum on the floor. Taking those hands over the head. Reaching and pushing those hands away. Strengthening, lengthening those legs out. Reaching and pushing those legs away. Feel the stretch through the fascia. Bring those hands back in. Bring those feet back in. Bend those knees up. Move that roller again. Just to loosen up. And then pop the bum on the floor. Turn into the chest. And lift this up all the way back up. <coughs> Got those legs out straight, lifting up nice and tall, breathing in. On the out breath, rolling all the way forward towards those feet, reaching all the way forward, loosening that head and neck, lifting that body up nice and tall. Roll those shoulders up to the ears, round and back. Pop the left hand on the right knee, right hand behind, lift and turn. And then pop the right hand on the left knee, left hand behind, lift and turn. Move that roller out of the way. Lift those arms up straight in front. We have a little, bit, little stretch of the hip now. Lowering that body down to the floor, all the way down, one vertebra at a time. Take those arms straight up into the sky over the heads. Push those hands away, reaching, let those shoulders lift up to the ears, and then pull those shoulders down away from the ears towards the waist. Bring those arms all the way up to the sky. Bring that right knee in, bring that left knee in, lift the tailbone up off the floor and release. Lift that tailbone up off the floor and release. Lift the tailbone up, bring that nose in and release. Push the tailbone down to the floor, arch that lower back, pull those shoulders into the ground, top ribs, middle ribs, bottom ribs into the ground, pull those knees in, so we're flexing those hip joints. Let the knees drop out wide as we pull them in. And then let those knees drop wide, wide. So open those hips up a little bit, as in let the knees go away from you. Having those hands on the inside of the knee joint, pushing the knees down towards the floor, hold them there. Push those knees into those hands, breathing in, breathing out. Push those knees into those hands, breathing in, breathing out, release. Let those knees stretch apart, lengthen that head from the neck. Let those knees stretch. Bring that right foot up into the sky. Bring the left foot up into the sky. Point those toes. Flex those feet. Point those toes. Circle with the feet one way. Circle with the feet the other way. Let those knees really pull apart. 
Press those knees in towards the arms. Keep the shoulders away from the ears. Lengthen the body so the lower back's not pushing into the floor. Breathing in. Breathing out. Release the push of the legs. Let those legs open further. Pull the shoulders away from the ears. Bend that right knee in. Bend that left knee in. Bring those legs together. Pull those knees in, pushing the tailbone down to the floor. Push that right leg out straight. Keep that left knee in. Pull that left knee up towards the shoulder, pushing the tailbone down so you're keeping your neutral spine position. Always keeping neutral spine unless we say otherwise. Pulling that left leg over the body to the floor on the, on the right. Pushing that left hand away, perpendicular to the body. Keep the shoulder away from the ear. Lengthen through that right leg, away from the top of the head, so you're nice and straight, pulling the left knee down. Breathing in, turning through those ribs, breathing out. Turning the eyes to that left hand, pushing the left nose, nostril to the ground. And then release over onto that right hand side, support the head with the underneath arm. Put that um, bottom leg a little bit bent to support the body. Take the top knee, top foot, sorry, in that um, left, hand, uh, left hand. Roll that shoulder up to the ear, round and back. Let the, left, the right leg drift forward for a bit of stability. Pull the pubic bone forward so it's in line with the tummy button and the breastbone. And then push this left foot into that left hand. Lengthening, keeping the knee hip height. Don't let the knee lift up. Pushing that knee, that foot into that hand, stretching that leg behind the body. Feel it in that hip flexor. Feel it in that inner foot, that um, quad. Stretching, let it go behind you. And then stop the push, but just lengthen. And then release. Let that leg go, roll back onto your back. Bring that same knee into the body. Pulling it in, turn that leg around, put that foot on the other knee, hold on to the other knee, pull it in, and push that left um, left hand on the left on the left knee, pushing that away. Have this thigh rotated. Hold that thigh in that position. Push that left knee into the left hand. Breathing in, pushing the shoulders away from the ears, tailbone down, lower back slightly elevated. Release the push with the knee and lengthen, pushing that hand against that knee and stretch. Let go of that right leg, let it go straight. Pull that left knee in, then let that left leg go away, hands overhead, reaching, stretching. Bring those hands up, bring that right knee in. Pull that right knee up towards that right shoulder, lengthening that left leg. Pull that left leg over the body. Put it all the way to the floor on the left hand side, pushing that right hand away, turning the eyes right, trying to get the right nostril to the floor, breathing in on the out breath, stretching that breastbone to the sky, pulling that hip over towards the floor, stretching through those ribs, keep that right shoulder away from the ear, lengthen that left leg, breathing in, breathing out. Rolling over onto that left hand side. Support the head with the underneath hand. Put the right foot into that right hand. Roll that right shoulder up to the ear down and back. Pushing that right foot into that right hand. Lengthen that leg behind you. Breathing in. Breathing out. Left, let that left leg come forward. Pushing that left, that right foot into that right hand. Let that leg come back, breathing in, breathing out. Pulling the pubic bone forward so that you're keeping that uh, torso and column, lengthening. And then just push the foot and hand away, stretching through that hip, keeping the knees hip height. Release that uh, foot, roll back onto your back. Pull that knee back up in towards the shoulder. Push that other leg away straight. Turn that leg, take hold of the foot. Bring that left leg in. Put the right foot on the left leg, pull the left leg towards, push the right leg away. Holding onto that right uh, knee. 
Push that knee into that hand. Breathing in. <clears throat> On the out breath, release the push and lengthen, pushing the hand into the knee, turning that thigh. And then release that left leg, let it go straight. Release the right foot, hold on to the right knee, pull it up towards the shoulder. Breathing in on the out breath, let go of that right leg, hands over the head, reach and stretch, let that back arch up. Let those shoulders come up to the ears, lengthen, and then pull those shoulders away from the ears and pull those hands up to the sky, bring those hands all the way over and down next to the side. Slide your fingers under your bum, breathing in on the out breath. Push those elbows into the floor, lift that body up, pushing that breastbone up to the sky. Breathing in, breathing out. Push those elbows into the floor, lift that chest up high. Breathing in, breathing out. Push that chest up high, filling those lungs up with air, stretching those ribs, squeezing those shoulder blades together. And then release, lowering that back down to the ground. Bring that left knee in, bring that right knee in, hug the nose to the knees, lift that head up, bring the nose to the knees. And then release, let that back, so still keep the knees bent, let the back come down to flat, head come down on the floor. So arching that lower back slightly, Pushing all those ribs into the floor, take those hands away from the legs, rest them on the ground. With those knees bent at 90 degrees still. Rotate that left thigh, tap that heel on the floor, keeping those shoulders away from the ears. Lift that left leg back up. Rotate that left thigh down to the floor, keep the core strong. Bring that left thigh back in. Take that left thigh down to the floor, hover it just above the ground. Slide that left leg out straight. Lengthen the head away from the, from the toes. Bring that left leg in, bring it back up. Take that left leg down to the floor, slide that left leg out straight. Bring that left leg back in, bring it back up. Take that left foot down to the floor. Slide it out straight. Bring it back in, bring it back up. Right leg. Tap that heel down to the floor, keep the knee bent. Lift that leg back up, free like this, just with the heel tap. Lower that heel down to the floor. Bring that heel back up. So we engage that core. Lower that heel down to the floor. Lengthen that leg out straight. Point the toe away, bring that leg back in, bring it back up. Two more, take that heel down to the floor, slide that leg out straight. Bring that leg back in, bring it back up. One more, take that heel down to the floor, slide that leg out straight. Bring that leg back in, bring it back up. Bring those arms up, bring that upper body up, pushing those hands away towards the feet, take the eyes to the sky. Take that left leg down to the floor, take it out straight. Bring it back in, bring it back up. Take that right heel down to the floor, take it out straight. Bring it back in, bring it back up. Two more. Left leg down to the floor, take it out straight, pull the shoulders away from the ears, bring that leg back in, bring it back up. Right leg down to the floor, take it straight. Bring it back in, bring it back up. Left leg down to the floor, take it out straight. Bring it back in, bring it back up. Right leg, take it down straight. Out, to, out straight, sorry, bring it back in, bring it back up. Lower that head and neck down to the floor, bring those arms all the way over the head, keep the shoulders away from the ears. Take that right foot down, take that left foot down, hover them off the floor, drawing in strong, lengthen both legs out straight. Neutral spine, pull those thighs into the ground. Look, slight lift off the lower back, so correct your torso. Push those bottom ribs in the floor, middle ribs in the floor, upper ribs. 
Make sure that tailbone's in, into the floor, lower back slightly lifted, connected at the lower ribs. Bring, lift those feet up, bring them back in above the hips, keeping that torso still, breathing in. On the out breath, lower both feet down to the floor, lengthen them out straight, correct that torso, make sure it's in neutral. Pushing the tailbone into the floor, lower back slightly lifted, ribs are on the ground, shoulders on the ground, shoulders away from ears. Lift those heels up, bring them back in, bring them back up. Two more, breathing in. On the out breath, take those legs over, slide those legs out, make sure you're in neutral. You should be getting better at finding neutral and staying there. So lower, lower back slightly lifted, ribs are on the floor, bring those legs back in, bring them back up. Breathing in. On the out breath, take those feet to the floor, slide those legs out straight. Hover them or just have them just connecting, bring them back in. Bring them back up, bring those arms up to the sky. Take hold of those knees, hug the nose into the knees and release. Put that left foot on the floor, put that right foot on the floor, slide those legs away. Take the hands up over the head, bring those arms all the way up to the sky, chin into the chest, roll yourself all the way up to sitting hands on the legs, reach yourself all the way forwards. So we get the body normal, we get it to be able to be in its straight position. Sit yourself up tall, take hold of that stick. Have those hands on the knees, stick on the thighs, lift yourself up tall. Hold the um, hands behind the thighs, pull that body up, bring that stick up in front of you. Bring that stick into the chest. Now, when I've got the stick into the chest, my hands are elbow width apart. So have them, make sure they're not too narrow. Push that stick forwards. Pull that stick back. When the stick comes back, elbows are shoulder height, hands are shoulder height. Push that stick forward. Bring that stick back, keep that chest up. So when your hands are back, Louise, put the uh, butt, stick on your chest, Louise, elbows, shoulder width, sorry, elbows, shoulder height, hands are shoulder width apart on the stick. Push that stick forwards. Bring that stick up in the sky so they're wider than shoulder width. Lifting yourself up tall. Now you're going to let go of the left hand, bring that right hand down to the floor so it's holding the stick. Now bring that left hand over, put it on the top of the stick and slide the right hand down to the floor. Breathing in. On the out breath, you're going to push that top hand into the stick. So you're reaching over to the side, stretching through that side, using the stick for support and for stretch. Push that body, push that left uh, seat bone into the floor. And then bring yourself back up, pushing off the hand, pushing off the stick. Bring that stick up into the sky. So we've got a hand on each end of the stick. Take the other end down to the floor with that left hand. Right hand's on the top. If I can get my left elbow to the floor, that's great. Breathing in on the out breath. Push that top, of the, that top hand, that right hand into the top of that stick. Push the body out sideways so it's keeping you honest, it's keeping you in one plane. Lift that chest up, stretching through that side. Breathing in, try and get your right arm straight. Try and get the right arm straight and then push off that stick. Come all the way back up, bring that stick up into the sky. So I think I discovered yesterday, my stick's about a metre long. Bring that right hand down to the floor. So if you've got a shorter stick, which I think Ros has, it'll make it a bit harder. Push that top hand into the stick. Push the breastbone up. Push that left arm straight. Push the side to the left. But it's not, it won't make it impossible. Pushing it up, uh, pushing that, up, that uh, left arm straight. And then push off that stick. 
Come all the way up over the other side, left hand into the floor, pushing that right hand on the top of the stick, pushing the ribs out sideways, breathing in. And on the out breath, push off that stick, bring yourself up to vertical. Bring that stick out to, uh, to horizontal in front of you. Soften your knees, bend forward, pop the stick over your toes. Breathing in on the out breath, push off those toes and stretch through those shoulders. Lengthen through those shoulders. Breathing in, breathing out, release those shoulders. Bring that stick back onto those shins. Lift that body up to the ear, back and down. Rest the, hat, rest the step, stick on, actually put the stick on the floor beside you. Rolling those shoulders up to the ears, down and back. Fingertips on the floor behind. Lean back onto your hands. Pull those elbows together. Lift that chest up high. Breathing in. Bend that right foot in. Bend that left foot in. Breathing out. Toes off the floor. Push through those heels and lift that body up it off the ground. Clenching with the bum. Working through that shoulder joint. Gliding forward a bit, gliding back, eyes to the sky. Lift yourself up, glide forward, glide back. Push through the heels, lift those hips up, forward, back. The higher the hips, the uh, more stretch in that shoulder. Glide, glide forward, glide back. Lower that body down to the floor. Straighten those legs up, push off those fingers. Hands on the legs, reaching all the way forwards towards those feet. Sitting yourself up nice and tall, roll those shoulders up to the ears, down and back. Pop those fingers on the floor, leaning back on those hands, pull those elbows together, breathing in. Breathing out, toes to the nose, pull the knees to the floor, clench through the bum, lift into that reverse plank. Hold yourself tall, bring those eyes to the sky, pushing off those hands. Breathing in, breathing out, lowering down to the ground, push off those fingers, reach down towards those feet, breathing in, breathing out, sit back up tall, lift that chest up, put those fingers back on the floor, leaning back onto those hands. Breathing in, make sure your feet are about a foot apart. Breathing out, lift yourself up, clench through the bum, Lift yourself tall, holding those shoulders up, pushing the torso up high. Bring that left knee into the body. Take that left knee, left leg out. Hips up high. Bring that right knee into the body, pushing the left heel in the floor, clenching the left bum, right leg out. Lower that body down to the floor, push off those hands, rolling all the way forward. We're releasing those re wrists, releasing those shoulders. Sit yourself up nice and tall. Roll those shoulders up to the ears, down and back. Put those fingers on the floor again. Leaning back on the hands, breathing in. Breathing out. Pull the toes to the nose, tighten the thighs. Lift those hips up off the ground. Holding yourself strong. Bending that right knee, put the uh, sorry right knee, put the left the right foot under that left leg, and rotate over onto that side plank. Ease yourself back onto that left hand. Put those feet back into that reverse plank. Take that left foot under the right knee and roll onto that uh, side plank the other way. Bring yourself back down, put those legs out straight, lift those hips up. Lower those hips down to the floor. Hands on the legs, roll yourself all the way forward towards those feet. Sit yourself back up, hold on to the underneath of those sides, lift that chest up, take hold of that stick in the hands. Push those knees to the floor, bring that stick up in front. Pull that stick back onto the chest. Push that stick forward. Pull that stick onto the chest, lift the chest up. Push that stick forward. Bring that stick up to the sky. 
holding it here. Take hold of the left hand of the stick, both hands on the top, drop the, drop the stick down to your tailbone. Feel your spine. Are you push the stick in the floor? Are you straight? So I'm not my so my waistband is slumping out. So I've got to come up on my seat bones more. Push my ribs back to touch that stick. Use this as a reference point. What does neutral spine feel like? Hold yourself there. Clench with the tummy. Remove the stick off the floor. Put it back above the head. Bring that stick in front, hold that body in, in that neutral position. Bring that stick back towards the chest. Hold that body neutral, push that stick away. Lift that chest up, bring that stick up overhead. Bring that stick down behind the head. Push the stick backwards for five, lift that tummy up for four, for three, for two. For one, push the stick up to the sky. Take hold of the left end of the stick in both hands. Drop the right end down towards the bum again. Are you, have you slumped? Push the stick hard down. Feel you straight. Take that stick away again. Hold it above the head. Bring it down behind you. Feel how it misses your head. Now you're straight. Push that stick up. Take the head at the top of the stick backwards. Bring it down parallel to the wall. Push it up parallel to the wall. So it's not coming a triangle, it's not coming over your head. Bring it down behind your back. Push it up, bring it down. Rest it on those shoulders, push it backwards, tap your back. Push it backwards, tap your back. Push it backwards, tap your back. Push it backwards, hold it there. Push it up high. Bring it down. Chest up. Push it up high. Bring it down. Hold it here. Lean backwards. Neutral spine. Bend those knees in if your thighs are going. Push that stick up. Bring it over in front. Lift that chest up. Legs straight. Roll yourself all the way forward. Pop those toes. Pop those toes over the stick. Soften the knees a bit, breathing in. Breathing out, push those toes away. Stretch through that back. Release, bring that stick back onto the legs. Lift yourself up nice and tall. Rest the stick on the floor. Put that left hand on the right knee, right hand behind, lift and turn. Keep those shoulders down and away. And then come back round to the front, put the right hand on the left knee, left hand behind, lift and turn. And then come round to the front. Roll those shoulders up to the ears, down and back. Roll those shoulders up to the ears, down and back, put the fingertips on the floor, lean back on those hands, pull the elbows together, breathing in. On the out breath, lift that chest up high, drawing in that core, breathing in. On the out breath, clench the thighs, heels into the floor, lift that bum up, hold yourself tall. Push the chest away from the, from the uh, upper arms, hold that body high, lower that body down, push off those fingers, sweep those fingers forward on the floor all the way up into the sky, all the way around. All the way down, dust the floor, all the way up in the sky, hold them together above your head, breathing in. Pull yourself forward onto that front bottom, lift that belly up, lift that chest up. Push those knees into the floor, push those hands up high. Release those hands out wide. Rest those leg, hands on your legs. And roll your shoulders. Well done. Good, that was a slightly different upper body. We didn't do cobra, well, we did reverse plank. 